Hello, 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 my Pisces. How all? How all? How are you guys doing? I hope you all are doing well. And how are you all swimming in this life of bullshit? But I feel like you guys are doing okay. Okay, I really do. Um, yeah. So this message is gonna be for you, Pisces, my water sign. Um, if you are new to this channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. Please feel free to like, share, comment down below, hit the notification bell so that every time I post, you are notified. Also, too, um, if you like to give a donation or you like to have a private reading, the information will be below the box. Okay. Um, and also, too, if the shoe fits real Cinderella, wear it. If it don't, don't try to get in where you don't fit in. Just find you another YouTube um, tarot reader, which are, there are hundreds, thousands of them, that resonates with you, okay? So we're going to get this popping. Let's see what this says. The chariot here in reverse, okay? Chariot here in reverse could be dealing with a cancer, but there's some reason why you're not making a move on something, or you don't want to make an investment on something, or you don't want to entertain any type of relationship on something, so you're basically on pause, which is not necessarily a bad thing, because you will probably want to just reevaluate um, the situation that I am getting. Let me see here. The high priestess here in reverse. Something you don't want to make a move on on Pisces because some secret has come out. Okay. Regretful. Someone's in the mode of, of, of um, you're, you're, I'm sorry, you're not regretful. You ha have released any regret that you have had, or you are releasing any regret of a certain decision that, that was made, because I feel like something was exposed and something came out. So you are basically on pause with this situation. Could be dealing with another water sign. Let me see. Yep. The Ace of Cups. If this could possibly be dealing with new love, or you may have decided to move in another direction with love. Some choice that was there, you decided not to move forward with. That's what I'm getting. Okay. Let me see. Uh, what I want to use here. Let's clarify this Ace of Cups here. Your cup is overflowing. So I just, I just feel like, Pisces, you're in the mode like you're just very careful. You're very careful, but guess what? Love is coming here. It's here. I feel like love, happiness, um, jobs, everything. You, uh, you know what? That's 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 what I'm getting here. It's like you've been through so much. Your tone here is the universe wants you to know that you know what? Your cup is overflowing. Your cycle is about to change. Um, you're just not going to invest in anything anymore. You're gonna take time to think about certain things. Things have just been revealed to you, and what I'm hearing. What's being revealed to you is just people, choices, the way the world moves. Nothing never stays the same. Um, and you're just you're just at a sense where, you know, you're just going to take your time with moving things because you're moving forward here with the five of cups here in reverse. You're no longer going to, I feel like you're no longer going to grieve over what happened in the past, what happened in the past, stay in the past. But I feel like you have, like, learned a lesson from it. Um, also, too, like, in... Um, in like a love reading as well. And this is not a particular love reading, but I'm just seeing everything here. To me, this is just like all the life dynamics here. Also, too, in a love reading, you know, the high priestess sometimes is, is like basically like, you know, if it's in reverse, like someone's not showing you high regard. So you're basically just saying, you know, you're not. If anything that don't show Pisces high regard, you're giving it the boot. You know, you only going to take a divine cup. You're not going to take no, no, no reversal cups. You're not going to take any knights, you know. You're not going to do that. You're going to take kings, you know. If, it is, if it's not king status, you don't want it. Okay, that's basically what it is. Holy Spirit, please clarify the Ace of Cups here for Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. The Ace of Cups here. Look at here, the King of Swords here in reverse. Okay. So there was once upon a time that you were dealing with someone who was very domineering, very brutal, bunch of full of lies and everything. Okay. You're not willing to, to um, be in that mode anymore. Okay. Let's see. Let's clarify the chariot card here in reverse. Why the chariot card here in reverse? Ten of coins here in reverse. Okay. Not going to invest into it. Okay. This could also mean, too, that someone did come along once before and give, gave you an ace of cups here. And this, this person found out, they, you found out this person was not exactly who they were. You know, who they, you know, perceived to be, okay? And the truth came out about them, okay? The ten of co the, the, the chariot here in reverse and the ten of coins here in reverse. You're basically, gonna, like I said, you're not going to invest in anything that you feel is going to cause you grief. You're just not going to do that anymore. Your lesson has been learned. 
the page of swords here, okay? But you are gonna move forward. I feel like I feel like you're getting like a like a reset on life. Like you're feeling like, okay, I'm 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 ready to. If you look at this, look at how the shadow is in the back there of the um there's a shadow that's kind of like a stick figure. Okay. So it's like you're in the shadow. Someone could be watching you too as well in the shadow. This could be an ex. But I get the sense that um, Pisces, you're feeling like, okay, I'm ready to really fucking swim right now. Like, I'm tired of just, you, you just got so tired of being in this mode with the five of cups here in reverse. You got so tired of that. Someone possibly wants to apologize to you as well. And this could be this king of swords here. But like I said, I feel like that, like this is past energy, but you're just not going to invest. You're not going to fully, you're not going to give all your coins and your stability and your emotions to someone right, right off the bat, right away. Holy Spirit, please clarify um, the high priestess here in reverse. Uh -oh. Why is the high priestess here in reverse? Someone may be texting you. I feel with this page of swords, maybe DM me, DMing you in your DMs or writing you a letter, an email. Um, yeah. The high priestess here in reverse here for Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. You have the Four of Swords. Okay. New beginnings, I feel. You was once in a you you was once in a mode of um, thinking about things, just thinking about a situation. Now you're coming out of it, um, sort of like feeling rejuvenated in a sense, wanting to move forward. You know, creating your own. Holy Spirit, please clarify. The five was cups here in reverse for Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Why is the five of cups here in reverse? The Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. The Hierophant. Hold on. Pisces, you could possibly be meeting someone where marriage comes on the table. Okay? I said that I felt like it was like a new time in five. A five is change. Okay? You got fives here. Change. Change up. Okay? You're moving forward. And the reason why you're able to stay. And I'm, I'm, I'm feeling like a marriage and everything. I, I really feel like things are really going to go well for you, Pisces. Because you decide not to, look in, not to look back in the past anymore. That's what I'm getting. Okay? That, like I said in the beginning, um, that Ace of Cups. Is basically the love of life. Like, it's really you holding in your hand. Okay? And, and notice how I say you holding in your hand and you have the, the four of coins here, the four of swords here in reverse. And that hand is there. Okay? If you have any questions about anything, you know, just call on your ancestors. Because I feel like some of you are do heavy candle magic. Or at least sage for the for, for the farmers. But just asking you shall um, receive because the tone of this message is the Ace of Cups. You know, that is a divine hand. The divine hand is going to help you with all your situation. Okay? Holy Spirit, what other messages that you have here? The Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Yep, the Seven of Swords. The Seven of Swords, someone, someone wants to apologize. I told you even with the Five of Cups, someone wants to apologize to you, um, Pisces. They want to come back. Yep, the Page of Coins. They want to apologize to you, okay? The Emperor, oh, wow, this could possibly be um, the father of your children. This person want to come back with heavy energy to apologize Okay, it's gonna take strength for you to say no. It really is. Let me see. Oh, the magician here. And the two of swords here. I'm here and take my hand.
take my hand, but I'm not getting a sense of that this is good energy because I feel like this is coming from the King of Swords that's up here in reverse, full of chaos. Okay, let me see. Let's go. Holy Spirit, I'm going to use the Kipper cards. Let me see what the Kipper has to say about this. So this person could be, listen, here's the thing. This could be an ex that's coming back and offering you marriage. Or this is someone completely different offering you marriage. But I feel like this right here is your ex. And not the person coming with the divine cup, if that makes sense. Okay? Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Give me three more cards here for Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. And in Venus. So there's reading. Two more cards here for Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. And in Venus for this reading. Message of concern. Did I not tell you somebody was going to send you a message? Or they're going to write you something. And I think this person, I think it's going to catch you off guard who this person is. It's going to be somebody I feel like you least suspected. Or like I said, it could be your child's father. Message of impri imprisonment. This person could be incarcerated. Okay? Or this person feel trapped without you. Okay? One more card here. Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Okay, despair. This this despair card keeps coming out. Okay. Yeah. Let me do this. Let me clarify this. Holy Spirit, please clarify the message of concern here for Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Please clarify the message of concern here for Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Him, the four of pentacles holding back holding back what though let me see holy spirit please clarify please clarify the imprisonment card here for pisces sun moon and rising imprisonment someone's feeling trapped that's too many cards but what came out was the Death card and the Knight of Pentacles. That's what came out. Slow moving energy. Something come to an end. Slow moving. Someone's trapped to where they can't. I don't know. Holy Spirit, please con please contact. Please um clarify the despair card. Please clarify the spare card. So this could be that, Pisces, you entered a situation. This person is really calculating on how they're going to come back to you. The spare card, look here. And then you got the Wheel of Fortune here. This could be a case where the person sees you already with someone and they're very hurt about it. They see you with someone already because you got the Ace of Goblet here, which is the Ace of Cups and the Wheel of Fortune here. This person is so afraid of you moving on without them, okay? And they know that you have the potential. And they're more than likely watching you on social media and everything. Or they see you with someone already and they feel like, you know what? I, oh, my God. You know, like, how can I get how can I get on Pisces back again? Because I feel like this is in their despair mode right now. That's what I'm getting here. Um, let me see. I'm going to pull out a couple of cards here from the Wisdom deck. And then we will be done with it. Holy Spirit, give me three cards here. Three 
This person may possibly be trying to come to you and talk to you and say, oh, I want if you have kids, I want to talk to you about the kids and such and such. And that's their way that they may try to maneuver to get back under your graces to possibly try to cause confusion between you and your others, okay? Holy Spirit, please clarify this deck here. Three more cards here, Holy Spirit. For Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Differences. Denial. And understanding. I think that's clear. This is, I feel like, talking about your ex or situation that you're in right now. There are many differences. A person is, you know, denying things that, um, that that was there. You all did not have an understanding with one another. And this is what may has caused a demise of the relationship. And now this person sees you with someone else. Um, and, and, you know, they just want to come in, I feel like, and they want to infiltrate that because you move forward, Pisces. You don't swim through all the bullshit. The lake of bullshit, you don't swim through. And now this person feels like that they understand um, the differences now. But it's like the universe is like denying them to have you. You're that fruit. You're that fruit that they can't reach, Pisces. Your ex, you're that fruit that they can't reach on the top of that tree. They will have to get boxes and ladders and... Yeah, you're that fruit that they can't reach. Okay? So with that being said, I am K-Star Moon Life. After, like, share, comment down below, and I will see you next time.